Good morning, everybody, and welcome back. And for all you new people out there, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell. We do appreciate it. So today's job is going to be replacing the primer bulb on a chainsaw. It's that time of year when everybody's pulling their chainsaws out to cut firewood, and they're seeing quickly that little primer bulb has cracks or leaks or whatever. Now, the primer bulb on a chainsaw doesn't work the same as it does on a weed eater or something where the primer bulb is attached to the actual carburetor. The way it works is the, the gas is pulled from the tank through the carburetor, and then out of the carburetor through the primer bulb, and then out of the primer bulb back into the tank. So it's sort of sucking gas through the carburetor. So you might have a bad primer bulb that doesn't leak at all. And you can tell because when you're pressing it, you don't see any gas ever show up in the bulb itself. So let's have a look at this one. Now taking a quick look at this one, it actually looks like it's okay, but you don't see any gas flowing through it. And you look a little bit closer at it, you can see there's a little crack right here in the side. And then with the light on it, when you press down on it, you'll see that indeed it is no good. I know, kind of hard to see on the camera. Be right there. So let's go ahead and put a new one on. Okay, the first thing we're going to do. Let's pull the top off and get it out of our way. And each chainsaw is a little bit different, and the covers are on a little bit different. But I chose this one because it's got a super common cover set. Probably about 80% of the home used chainsaws out there use this basic cover set. Now I'll pull the side cover off, and there's four screws holding it. Now the only thing still holding it together. Oh. There we go. There's our last screw. And there's our primer bulb. Now she's a whole lot easier to get to. Let's pull you in a little closer. So in order to remove this, it's pretty easy peasy. A screwdriver and pop it and it pops right off. Now let's grab a new primer bulb and put a new one on. The best part about replacing a primer bulb is these are super generic. This same primer bulb will fit on just about any chainsaw or weed eater for that matter that has this priming system. So looking at our fuel lines, they look pretty good. What you want to pay attention to is you've got one long and one short. And you see you've got the same on this one. Don't worry about what they do, just match them up. So put the short one on the short one. Long one on the long one. And just as an FYI, the short one goes to the carburetor and the long one returns back to the fuel tank. And as you can see, that new primer bulb works pretty good. So I'll clip her back into place. Yes, I think we will. And it's just two little plastic tabs. Usually I have this straight up and down when I do it. And there it is. And we'll put our covers back on and we're finished. And it really is just that easy. We're done. So if you get your chainsaw out after sitting all summer and you see the primer bulbs cracked, 
It's just that simple to put a new primer bulb in. And you can buy these new primer bulbs on Amazon for probably 4 or $5 for a pack of five or six of them. They're really cheap. So thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.